Hi, Hollywood Reporter from Comic Con 2013. We are so excited to be at the Hollywood Reporter interview station. I only read one magazine about Hollywood. And it's the Hollywood Reporter. I have to say that your sister magazine, the Inglewood Reporter, is not nearly <laughs> as impressive. T H R, take one. Action. Star Trek versus Star Wars. Star Wars. Oh God, they're here. What? Oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> oh, That's no. very brave of you. <laughs> Except for the more recent Star Trek. Star Wars was. I feel, introduced us to space and the, the new frontier before anything else did. But I'm sure um, no, I'm Grillo sure. can speak no, no, on it. No. He's a Star I, Trek no, guy. I am a Star Trek Of guy. course you are. I am a Star Trek guy. Okay. Yeah. I didn't watch either one of them. Oh, Will was oh God. God. Star Trek. Why? I love Captain Picard. Make it so. It's how wars. I am a Star Wars fan. I'm also an Elvis fan, and I kind of wondered what would happen if Elvis were a Jedi? The rebel said, Jedi, Elvis, won't you sing? You should have heard them cheer for the Jedi King. Let's rock. Everybody, let's rock. Mine. George Lucas gave us space. He gave us animals. George he gave Lucas us... didn't give me space. What? He didn't give me no space. You know how he made no, you know the what? George, I auditioned oh, for that movie. Uh, George Lucas didn't give me problem. nothing. That's the problem. <laughs> solo. Nerd and geek. What is, what is the dividing difference? Um, I'd say that nerds are more on the smart side. Geeks are more just excited about things. I mean, as a little kid, I stood in a long line to meet Hulk Hogan. <laughs> I was big into WWF. Who wasn't? That, that, was, that was great stuff. I was super into professional wrestling. Oh, I like, like way, way, way into, not doing it, but, but yeah. yeah, like I went to see a lot of those matches. Okay. Road Warrior. Iron Cheek. Junk, junkyard Dog? Junkyard Dog, for sure. Hulk Hogan many times. A geek is a socially awkward nerd. I had the first issues of Teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles, and, and then my mom threw them out. Oh. And she, we, I still remind her about that. It's new kids on the block. Whoa. I'm totally judging you right I'm now. Sorry. I'm sorry. We are going to talk about this one on set. I had a Farrah Fawcett poster. Am I right? There you go. <laughs> <laughs> I think the stupidest obsession was uh, pogs. You have a slammer, which is a harder coin, and then you flip little paper things, and then you could take them if you win them from your friends. I had like ridiculous hammer slammers, which are like this thick, like like finger imprints, so that you could get the good grip on it, and then you just <laughs> wham, <laughs> wham. It's the thing you'll miss the least about working with friends. Underpants. <laughs> Those, wow, those, uh, you're, you're keeping those on, right? He was always roaming around in his tidy whities even when he wasn't. When he didn't yeah. need to be. Like when his, he was doing the, the close-up shots where it's yeah. here up, yeah. he just decided to take off his pants. Yeah. That, was, that was odd. Yeah. At this point in the series, you've had a lot of Walker kills. I love all my kills, equally. <laughs> <laughs> someone to put together on YouTube like Michonne's kills and they yeah. just put them back to back to back and I was like I work hard for my money <laughs> <laughs> they keep reinventing ways to do it and that's what's so great I apocalypse I would go to a Costco and I would lock the doors and I would go on the roof it's the perfect way to solve a zombie apocalypse I have thought about this zombies are a cakewalk compared to what we do yeah. Yeah. Walk in the park. Zombies is like a holiday for us. <laughs> <laughs> Slow moving, easy to kill. No weapons. No yeah. weapons. Yeah. Smell them coming. Stupid. I would plant tobacco because I think it'd be a good thing to trade with. <laughs> yeah. Zombies like, yeah. like, whoa, wait, hold on. I have some old guy tobacco left. Holy shit, this is good stuff. We can't go out there. We can't go out there. The zombies are out there. The zombies are out there. That was a bit more, I was trying to do Scorsese. It sounded more like Steve Buscemi. What is your favorite superpower that Superman has? Super strength. Super strength. So can you give me a little, oh, like that? Who is someone whose mind that you would love to read? 
Oh, I already know what's going on in her mind. Oh, uh, oh, uh, oh. Uh, uh, yeah. I'm not going to do it. It's just a soundtrack I'm not going on in there. Oh, 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 oh. Probably the ability to uh, overpower a filibuster and join both sides of Congress together and get some shit done in America. That's what I would like. It's credit in there. No, it was an donkey's ace. thinking. <laughs> Let's have a look at a clip. <laughs> I want to be where the people are. I want to see you want to see them dancing. Goodbye, Goodbye Hollywood, Hollywood reporter. reporter. We love you forever. <laughs> Hey, we're the cast of The X-Files, and you're watching The Hollywood Reporter online. Uh, but we're not yeah. reading it. Goodbye, Hollywood Reporter. <laughs>